Happy Thursday. So with yesterday I was talking about, you know, what's your worry? Are you indulging in this worry story? Are you, you know, on some level praying for the worst thing that can happen if all you're doing is circling around this tragic idea or story or obsession um, of what's not going to happen or you're going to be destitute or you're never going to be in love or you're unlovable or whatever, fill in the blank. Which brings us back, brings my thinking back to what's the narrative that you're telling yourself. We spend the most time that we spend with anybody, we spend with ourselves. And what's the narrative that's going on while you're not talking? What's the narrative, or maybe you talk to yourself like this guy. Um, what's the narrative that you say? Is it always negative speak? Is it, you know, critical and hyper, hypercritical and hyper aware and really negative? Because I know that that's what my story was for a very long time. And to break free from that and to recondition that internal monologue to a compassionate, loving, parental, and maybe not even the parent that raised you, but how you would parent yourself the most loving way possible. And continuing to take control of that narrative rather than letting your old narrative hijack you and just tell you an old history that you no longer want to embrace. It's a lot. I, I, <laughs> it, it gives each of us an immense amount of power to reclaim our narratives, to reclaim the stories that we're telling ourselves. And the idea that you are powerless over that, I think, is victim mentality and, and nonsense. Um, yeah. So what's your narrative and how would you reshape that? And how, if you have, not even if, you have the control to tell yourself anything what are you telling you what are you telling yourself when nobody's talking answer that question and then move on from there and be like okay this is what i need to adjust this is this is you know and and maybe if you need to i hope that you have a community of people that you can bounce these possible truths off of like am i a bad person of course you're not a bad person or you've got some things to work on but you're not you know you're not as bad you know I'm general <laughs> I have generally never been as bad as I thought I was um, because of my hypercritical nature of who I think I was or am and so I need you know a supportive community to to help me know the truth of what's happening sometimes the truth about myself. Much love.